Hi everybody, this is Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm gonna show you how to boost your FPS in Assassin's Creed Origin. Uh, we will start with the in-game menu and after that I will show you where is the config file and you have a couple of settings that you can change in the config file that uh, you're not able to do it inside of the game, okay? So let's start. First of all, window mode. Make sure that you're playing full screen. I saw an improvement, full screen versus borderless. So use that one. After that, hardware, blah blah blah, don't need it. Resolution, uh, here again, If after all the change that I uh, did, uh, you still don't have your 60 FPS, maybe you should just lower your resolution. Again, depending on what you're playing. If you're playing on the laptop, small uh, screen, you're probably not playing in 1080p. But anyway, this is something else. Uh, resolution modifier, we will touch it in the config file, so... Just stay at 100 for now. Make sure that your refresh rate is matching your screen. Me, I have a 144 hertz screen. If you have a 60, just put 60 over there. VSync, you should use off. You don't want input lag when you're playing. Fill of view, don't touch it. Just use the default one. And FPS limit, use off because you want to unlock your FPS in the game. Let's start with the graphic. So first of all, if you have a low-end computer, you can start at low or even medium. Low end, mid, uh, mid range computer. If your computer is old or maybe a laptop, uh, start at low, and I will tell you what we, we will change and what you can improve. And if you have a mid range slash high end computer, that like when I say high end, it's more like a 1060, maybe even a 1070, depending on your CPU, because some people are bottlenecking on their CPU, some other are bottlenecking on the GPU. So it really depends over there. Uh, yeah. So we will. Use medium over here. Make sure dynamic resolution is at off. This one can take a lot of resources. Shadow. This one is really important. For me, it's not a big... Uh, how I can say? It doesn't decrease a lot your image quality. And you should definitely put this one at low. For each bracket, you will gain 3 to 4 FPS. So uh, for sure, very low. It's really good because, honestly, you don't really mind about shadow on the floor uh, from objects, trees, or your character. And uh, you can gain a nice chunk of FPS for this one. Uh, Anti-aliasing, don't put that off because you will see all the object objects are like, you will see the line are kind of like breaking. So uh, use minimum of low, but on a set medium, you should be fine. Uh, I didn't see that much improvement between medium and low. You will maybe gain 2 FPS if you go to low. So just use medium for this one. This one is really important. Uh, go to low or medium. Um, the thing with this one is you will see a lot of environment details if you put like very low you will see that the game doesn't look really good so for me this one is kind of a game breaker so maybe just go with medium touch other setting that i will tell you like shadows and after that you can come back for this one because for sure you will gain a lot of fps to decrease this one but uh yeah you will lo lose a lot of the graphic quality Texture detail, this one, you will not see a big increase, man. It, it depends on the VRAM on your video card. So if you have like a 4 gig card, go with high or even medium. Uh, if you have a video card with just 1 gig or 2 gig, uh, for sure go with low or very low, okay? Tessellation, honestly, this one is running well on NVIDIA card, but I saw in those old AMD card like the... Uh, 6,000, 5,000, 7,000, 200, even the 300. Uh, this one can cause issue with AMD, so go with off. You will see a huge increase if you have that problem. I saw an increase, man, sometimes 8 to 10 FPS because I have some weird bug. My game was slurring uh, like crazy on my uh, 380. And uh, yeah, if you have an MD card, just remove this one. You will maybe see a huge improvement uh, with this one. Terran, uh, this one low, medium to high. I didn't see a huge improvement, it's like 2 FPS, so just maybe stay at I and uh, change it after if you, you see that you're still not having your 60, but honestly at I you should be fine. Clutter, this one is very, very important, honestly if you have a laptop just play very low, remove all those grass, rocks, stuff like that, you will see a big improvement, 3 to 4 FPS for each one, so this one is a huge one, so maybe low if you want to see a little bit of grass, but you will see a nice improvement over here. Fog, uh, fog again, weird the performance issue with AMD, don't know why on the 300 and the 200 series. Uh, this one, if I go at I, 
I was losing like 7 FPS just to, to get like some accuracy in the fog. So with AMD, you should definitely test this one. If you have an Nvidia car, uh, you can probably stay at high if you have something like a 970, 960, uh, 1060 and all those uh, kind of beautiful cards. Uh, water. This one, honestly, it's, it's just when you see water, so you should maybe put it at low because I saw a huge drop of FPS when you're near water and you look at the water. Uh, so if you don't want those kind of drop and you don't have like a big video car, honestly, just put it at low and uh, you will be fine. Same thing here with the reflection. Uh, depending on where in the map, if you look at the water and you're, you're running, you will see a huge drop in your FPS, so you can't um remove this one uh yeah this one is kind of important you will see a nice uh, improvement when you're looking at some stuff that can reflect volumetric cloud this one very weird again i'm getting huge increase when i remove it on my uh, amd card on and my nvidia uh, you're getting an increase but not like the amd uh for sure if you have a low end or mid range computer just remove this one you will see a lot of improvement and that's pretty nice Character detail and character. Honestly, I didn't see a huge improvement over there. This one, one to two FPS for each bracket. Texture detail, not really. Uh, it it depends. If you have like a, again a one gig car, maybe you will see uh, an improvement. But honestly, don't touch it. Just stay at medium. Ambient inclusion. This one off. Uh, it's some kind of like. It's a bit like the shadow, but uh, you will gain two FPS with this one. And the depth of feel. Depth of feel. Sorry. Uh, again, depending on where you are in the map, sometimes it's really good, sometimes it's, it's not. Uh, I feel like the game is blurry when you remove it, so just stay at on, but maybe you can change it if you have, you have issue with your FPS. After that, you can go in the config file. The config file is in your document, Assassin's Creed, and open the, folder, uh, the file uh, ACO for Assassin's Creed Origin, and you will have this uh, file over here stuff that you can change first of all bloom bloom normally by default is at one I really don't like this effect so this one you can remove it by the config file you can't inside of the game so make sure that uh, this one is at one uh, at zero sorry you can gain two to three FPS just with this one also texture filtering if you have like a low-end card you can do zero over here you will see an improvement but this one is not that huge okay honestly you will not see a crazy improvement but still it will work and uh, finally pixel density this one is the it's kind of the resolution scatter uh normally by default the game is at one like this but uh, you can go lower than that this is last resort because you will see that if you go under one uh, you will start to see blurry pixels and stuff like that you can do something whoops something like 95 uh, the game will not look like crap and you will gain a nice chunk of FPS, but uh, the slider in the game goes until 0.5, but with the config file you can go lower if you want, but you will see your game will look like shit, honestly it's not even playable, so uh, yeah. So that's about it guys, if you have any questions just comment in the YouTube section, post me your GPU, CPU, RAM, I will try to help the best that I can, and don't forget to sub to the channel, thank you guys, peace!